happens to the castle now? Like, I almost felt like it, it was almost like a live connected to Dracula. And yeah, it, they just, didn't they destroy the mechanism that teleports it too, right? So, is it stuck here now, too? Whatever that place is that it got teleported to. <laughs> Go to your room. <laughs> what do you think he's going to do now? I had Ooh, Alucard? Now. I was going back to Bridget. Yeah. Uh, what? Do you want to go back to sleep? All his work is yeah. His libraries. His materials. Okay. His knowledge. What happens to all that if the structure is abandoned? Um. I can't. Just why do you care? Be nothing but a grave to So be burn it. Why do you care about his possessions? Let it be my grave. Oh, this is supposed. No. This is gonna be no. your tomb. Right on top of the Belmont Hole, <laughs> which is now also open to the world. Yeah, that's Up ironic. There, your father's collected knowledge. <laughs> down there, as above. Wow, below. that's poetic. I bequeath you the Belmont Hole. What? Make that and the castle your home, not your grave. Be its last. Whoa. Giving me <laughs> Protect it. Make something out of it. Something better than a pile of ruins and a symbol wow. of terror. I like that. Oh, look at Isaac. Stuck in a freaking desert somewhere. <gasps> Ooh, someone found him. Oh, what do we have here? Who found him? What is that? Is. Yes. You probably <laughs> do. The, Your kind always. These does. motherfuckers are fighting him over the water. Put a rope around it. Drag what? it us. Perhaps we can sell it at the next town. Unless we get hungry between now and Wow. Then. I'm not human. Oh, I'm sure you're human. Sir philosopher of the world. Yeah, I, I don't I don't know who this guy is, but just just I die, my guy. Just go away. Kill him, Isaac. Me neither. Yeah, make him dead. Oh, you see, you're dead. Night nice knowing you, whoever you were. But you you dead. And I, now your homie's dead! And your other friend's dead! Yeah, are all dead. Ow! Uh, oh! I thought they were gonna surrender. Dude, you had no reason to fight them. You could have just came up and be like, alright, dude, look. It wasn't me, it was blonde guy. I don't know. He saw your shiny ball head. It's not my fight, but no, see, you wanted something. Now you did. <laughs> Wait, what? What meat is? What are you eating? Are you? Oh, is he eating the horse? Who? Are huh? Um, my guy. Who? I could have an army. Who are you talking to? Did he wait all day to be like, all right, now I, I know like the comeback. An army. Like, dude is dead. <gasps> but wait, I just realized something. He just said army. He can bring it back. <gasps> oh my god! He's gonna bring it back! He's a little dead army. Wicked. Oh, but you brought him back. That's a weird demon thing. Help me find some more people to add. To <laughs> oh wow! And now you're being dragged in the desert, huh? I I see the the, the poetry for full circle. I get it. That's clever. <laughs> Look, we know at least some of Dracula's army landed at Brela. 
Yeah. Are the Nighthorns just going to go home? Touche. Well, no, There's still the a lot more to do, but the bigger and picture was just to happening? kill off Dracula. I love how baby girl's like, yo. Then we're there's still finished, more to do. Are we? And I don't want to stop. <laughs> I kind of agree with her. This is what we're doing. Kill more vampires. I think you should see it through. <laughs> Whoa. With you. Yes. You could be my ah. sidekick. <laughs> is the sun down? Hey, it's Hector. No coin. And Carmilla. Do you think Dracula lives? No. We have viewed the castle with mirrors. But you can't be sure. I can. Dracula no. is Hector. Yeah, because you're... You're... Does that trouble you? Yeah. Of course it does. Poor Hector. Stand up for me. <gasps> Ooh. Are you gonna turn him? You gonna kill him? Hector? You uh. look like shit. I know. Don't worry. We'll look after you. What? Camilla. What is what that? The humans of this region weakened and the yes. power structure of the vampire world. I am not, to take not explaining to the collar. Forge master. <laughs> you will create the horde for me. Go to hell. Wow. <laughs> wow, Hector, look at what you've done. Now you're just a bitch. <laughs> She's like, ah, my hand. <laughs> Whoa. <sighs> you are my pet now. My pet. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow. Good pet. <laughs> <sighs> Dude, you chose wrong. You played the Game of Thrones wrong. <laughs> wow, she's making Hector walk. My dude. It's a shame though, like... They're gonna go adventure, gun ho! But Alistar... Or Alistar... Alucard... What am I saying? <laughs> Alucard is staying behind. Never. And... This guy's a bumbling idiot. <laughs> ah, he gave him the finger. God, they're never going to be friends. I don't get first billing. Of course not. You're the one driving the horse. Is this what I've got to look forward to in life? Yes. See? Yeah. Bow chicka bow wow. She's like, dude, you're hit. You're stuck with me now. <laughs> and then, oh, God, we gotta see how depressing things are gonna be for poor little Alucard. Like, what do you do now? You got a whole castle for yourself. What do you, you go sit down all day? Go to your room, sleep. <gasps> I would be shit. Team Bricks. If I actually saw that. But I think he's just reminiscing. Nah, dude, you got you gotta get a better chair than that. You you, you Dracula had that awesome ass, big ass freaking king chair. Nah, dude. It's a lame chair. <laughs> My dude is gonna be driven insane. If he's gonna spend his whole days alone, he's gonna be like stuck remembering his family, his mom and dad. Uh, Ma, I don't know, man. I will probably tell the town folks, "Hey, come on, party!" Yeah, no, I think my dude. You gonna need some fresh air. Wow, what a brutal, somber way to end the season of just Alucard just weeping 
And, and my God, wow, what a freaking season. What a freaking show. I'm not a crazy Castlevania nerd, geek person. I, I have some of the video games. I played some of them when I was young. And it's not like I'm, I, I want to play them, but man, this show is making me want to play them. It's making me like, yo, Konami, make another badass, uh, Castlevania game. This season was freaking fantastic. If, if not, one of the best animated shows I've ever freaking seen. I love the gothic loreness of it all. I love the background drops. I love the illustrations, the musical score, the voice acting, the story, the drama. Oh, it's, it's been nothing but extraordinary. Praise the production value. Praise the direction. This show is really, really good. And it's surprising to hear that this particular show was, was supposed to be a movie or somewhat of a movie. I know, I'm sure same, I'm sure some things were changed to fit into a cartoon, but my god, if what we just saw, like what the season was, the show was a movie, it would have been freaking awesome. Now, like, wow, I've been wanting this for a very long time, uh, to have an animated show be taken extremely seriously as far as this production value goes, as far as, as far as the story goes, and then also do it like your typical season, you know, your, your typical, uh, television shows, you know, give it that high production value of like 10 episodes per season, come in, do its thing, give you that lore, give you that drama, give you that entertainment value, and then boom, see you next year, like man, whoosh, I want more, <laughs> they did such a great job, that that's how I feel, like I'm like, yo, I really cannot wait to see uh, season 3, and I want to speculate on so many good ideas that season 3 can be about. I love how they left so many things open-ended that Season 3 can go in so many different directions. I, just, I cannot wait. Now, before I even get there, let's just still talk about Season 2. Oh, my God. Ah, uh, man, I really love uh, the direction of uh, Season 2. Uh, of course, we can debate about which season's better, is Season 1 or 2. Uh, season 1 only had four episodes, so it didn't really have that much leg uh, to move around with. But Season 2 was, wow, fantastic. Had a great story, developed a lot of new characters. God, Brand was freaking awesome and annoying, but he did his parts. Here I thought Hector and Isaac were going to be like this uh, Doom Patrol kind of characters. of like, yay, you know, silent but deadly. But no, um, they, they're almost two characters that seem so tragic in this world of vampires and monsters. I love Dracula a lot. I love them a lot. Just because there are so many vampire movies I've seen as a kid and as an adult, of course. But uh, be it that this is animated, I, I've yet to see, um, and maybe because of the voice actor himself as well, but man, he did such a fantastic job of conveying the dread, the gloom in Dracula. You try to stay ahead of the show and be like, yeah, no, no. Dracula really wants to kill everyone, but then it's like, wait, does he? Is this really just a suicide? Does he really even care if anybody dies? He, he wants to kill himself just as much, you know? And uh, to see the dread in Dracula, to see the sadness and the sorrow, fan-fucking-tastic. I love the banter between uh, Belmont and Alucard. I love that hate. I love that uh, love-hate relationship between them. It played off so well. I love the action and the cinematography and the choreography uh, through, all, through all of it. And I love the dread that's being built up for season three with Carmilla, with Hector, with Isaac. And even now with Elicard, the way the uh, season ended. Like, yo, he's going to fall into darkness. I think it's a horrible idea to let him just stay in that castle as a prisoner, per se. No one deserves that kind of life. No one deserves that kind of exile. So, I can only imagine what kind of damage that does to a person, you know? Now, I don't know where the, this show can go. Like, I don't really know how much more canon this show is going to take away from the, the video games. Because, again, I don't really know too much of them anyway. I, I'm just, I'm excited. I'm at all. I'm just, wow. Season 2 was a freaking masterpiece. 
So, alright, that about wraps up my video for today. I would love to know what are your thoughts. What did you think of Castlevania? Did you like it? Did you hate it? I would love to know. So make sure you leave me any of those thoughts down in that comment section. Feel free to like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't before. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram and support me on Patreon. And as always, God bless you. Thanks so much for watching and farewell for now. Bye-bye.